Hey guys, my name is Tanya and guess what today is? That's right, today is Timu Tuesday. I know I'm all alone this time, but if y'all watched last week, then you already know that. I made y'all a promise last week about my favorite face cream that I've been using, y'all. So for one, I don't have any makeup on. I can't believe I'm gonna do an entire video with no makeup on. I have like a tad bit of mascara just to make sure that you can see that I do in fact have eyeballs and a little bit of lip gloss because my lips were extremely dry and that's it. The reason for that is because we are going to do this moisturizer together. Uh, I'm gonna show you what I bought off of Amazon and then I'm gonna show you what I bought off of Timu and show you the differences between the two. This has been like going viral all over TikTok, all over Instagram, everywhere about this face moisturizer. We are gonna get into that, uh, but first I do still wanna show you a few items that I recently picked up as well. And that's going to include this shirt right here. We have uh, an event down here in Mississippi every year that's called Cruise in the Coast and it's where about 9,000 cars, those cars are just registered. There's more than that that show up, uh, tons more that don't register. It's a week long event and it's all old cars. So I will put uh, what it's called up here on the screen and go ahead and Google it. You're, if you're into cars, old cars whatsoever, make sure y'all check that out because you're gonna love all the photographs. There's just so many events that go on. But I bought this shirt specifically to wear to cruise in the coast. I will probably wear it more often than that as well, but I did buy it for cruise in the coast. So check this out. All right, I paid $6.29 for this shirt. Look at it. Look at how cute it is. And it's all the way around. It has like the tie dye all the way around check it out and this is not like a um iron on this is actually like part of the shirt so you don't have to worry about it crinkling or anything like that i love this and the little license plate right there even says cruising i love this shirt i'm definitely going to wear it more than just cruising the coast but that's originally what i bought this shirt for now i do want to apologize for that crazy scammer or bot or whatever that was that went into the comments of last week's video. That was absolutely insane. I don't even wanna say the word. I had a bunch of you tell me that if you say the word, that that's what happens, that somehow these bots can pick up on that. And then it's like, becomes this like big scammer. So I don't even wanna say the word, but if y'all watched last week's video, maybe I can write it somewhere here. That, is supposed to happen next week as long as all of Tim's stuff gets in. He has like nine orders for some reason have not shown up here yet. I have all of my stuff. Everything that I ordered has come in, but he seriously has nine orders that are not here yet. And I'm like, that's crazy to me. I think I only have like two or three orders that haven't come in for me, but those are, I just ordered them like a week ago. So poor guy, he's still waiting for his stuff. So it is going to happen next week, next Tuesday, if everything comes in and it's just our way of giving back to you. It's uh, appreciation. All you're gonna need to do is just make sure that you're subscribed to the channel. And yeah, we will open up everything in next week's video hoping that it's all here, crossing our fingers that everything has come in by next week's video, we will open everything up and then give you the directions on what you will need to do. And then the following week, we will draw a name. So we're pretty excited about it. I'm not gonna say the word, but if you've been watching for the last few weeks, then you already know what I'm talking about. All right, let's get back into the other stuff that I bought. I had talked about this bra last week and then I told you I got a different color coming in because I got it on this like bonus thing. It came in and I bought this for $1.97. And I'm gonna tell you the, the last week's video, the bra I got last week, I have wore at least two to three times 
And I gotta tell you, I am really loving it. So I'm super happy that I went ahead and picked this one up too. This one's just, it's called Skin Tone Color. And it's the same exact bra as the other one. This one's just in a skin tone color. And it's got the mesh right here in the front. It is uh, padded on the inside. It has like a cotton padding on the inside. This padding is not removable. I saw people putting on some of the uh, reviews on the actual bra itself saying that the padding is removable. No, it's not. So they're fibbing or they're just reviewing something else. I don't know what they're doing, but the padding is not removable. But I'm going to tell you right now, I really, really am enjoying this bra. It is neck and neck with my favorite bra that I have. And it is so much cheaper than my favorite bra. So I'm probably going to order a couple more colors of this one. Okay, next one. This is for the house. So I'm going to demonstrate this for you because I'm, I hope that it works the way that I want it to. I paid $5.98 for this. And I have one of those Swiffers. You all probably have them too. I, I think just about everybody has some sort of Swiffer in their house. This doesn't even have to be for the Swiffer. It could probably work for the Shark or whatever else because it's supposed to be universal. So here is the pad right here. And if you all know, I have four dogs. So we're constantly cleaning these floors around here. And we have all hardwood floors. So this should work pretty well. Here is the pad right here, but check this out. It is Velcro. So this should Velcro around the back of the actual, uh, whatever it, whatever type of mop it is that you're using. And then you should be able to just throw this right in the wash machine. I'm gonna demonstrate this for y'all. And so cross your fingers that it works as well as I want it to, but for six bucks for two of them, if these work really good, I'm gonna order some more. Okay, so this is the regular Swiffer Wet Jet. This thing fits on there perfectly. You still have the holes open where the stuff comes out. Watch. Uh, Look it. It works. Yeah, this is too exciting. I'm definitely uh, going to be ordering more of these. And then you can just sit there and throw them in the washer afterwards. Works great. So y'all know that I got that uh, Stanley dupe cup that has like the puppy paws all over it. Let me see if I can find the other one. So I bought the little bottom, right? This is like the little rubber bottom that goes on it to keep it from slipping around because they're all metal. I paid $1.34 for this. And when I ordered this one, uh, I ordered it to match the color of my cup that I have. And so this does that. It does match the color of the cup. Cause like in my Jeep, um, the holder where the cups go in the Jeep are uh, a little bit bigger than the Stanley style cup. So this will keep it from like rocking around and moving around sliding cause it's a rubber bottom. So that's all this is, is just the rubber bottom. And I'll show you what it looks like on the cup. But after I bought this one, I actually found one that matches my cup. So I'm going to show you that one. Okay, so here's the one that actually matches my cup. It also has little paws on there. I paid $2.98 for this one. Yeah, this is cute. Now my paws, I think on my cup are silver. So these are going to be little black paws. So that'll be a cute little contrast to the cup. How adorable is that? I love this. So I'll show you what this one looks like on the cup and show you what this one looks like on the cup. I could tell you... This one, what I say this one was, it was, this one was $1.34 and this one was $2.98. And this one is a lot, is made a lot better than this one. This one's a lot thinner rubber than this one is. This one holds its form and you can just tell by looking at it that it's a lot thicker. This one's very well made. Um, yeah, it was twice the price, but again, it'll probably hold up a lot longer. I'm excited to get these. I bought these for the Jeep because in our Jeep, um, the sun visors are small. In most Jeeps, I imagine that's the way that they are. But in ours, we don't have any mirrors at all. When you flip down the visor, you know, to check your hair or whatever, and you definitely need to do that if you own a Jeep because the top's usually off or the windows are down or the doors are off or whatever. So you kind of want to check the hair. Well, ours doesn't have any mirrors at all 
other than your um, rear view mirror. So I found these on Timu. They were $3.59. This is a great buy. This is a great buy. Now these did not come with batteries. So I did find batteries and put batteries in them so that I could show it to you. And you can get the batteries off of Timu because the batteries that I have actually came from Timu <laughs> for something else. But here they are right there, the little mirrors. And I'm gonna show, they just clip on too. These aren't like the stupid elastic that the elastic wears out. These are actually metal clip on. And so we are gonna go out to the Jeep and I'm gonna show you these installed as well. Okay, here's what it looks like with the little LED lights on. I had to clip it on the bottom because my visor is less thick on the bottom, but yeah, I love this. This is perfect. And here's what it looks like without the light on, just so that you can see it. There it is right there, clips on no problem and fits on there great fits perfectly actually this was an excellent buy honestly you know that i have four dogs right well three of my dogs get those little um runny eyes you know and where it like stains uh their fur and stuff under their eyes because they get the runny eyes well i saw these on timu and i thought that I would give them a try. So they're just these little wipes that you use on their face. And it's just called wipes for pets and they're called sterilization and decontamination. It's 120 pieces in here. And I paid 332 for these. I had to get the scissors out to get this off. This stuff, this was strong on here. Okay, let's see. So here's just the little pads right here and I'm gonna try them out on the babies for you. Okay, remember last week when I got that little resin ring and I was like, man, they sent me the wrong color, and they did. So I ordered the right color, the color that I was looking for to begin with. I paid $1.28 for this. I love these little resin rings. You don't ever have to worry about them turning color or changing color or anything like that. They're always gonna look the way they're gonna look. Never gonna change. So I don't know if you remember last time I ordered, I ordered like a, a seven and I couldn't even get it to fit like my regular finger, which it should have. So I feel like these rings run a little bit small. So if you ask me for the link for this, just remember I would order a size up from what you normally wear because honestly, this is no different. I ordered the eight and it's still not really gonna fit on this finger, but it is gonna fit on this one, which is where I wanted to wear it was right there. So yeah, I ended up having to, that seven was like gonna be on this finger. And I normally wear like a five and a half, six on this finger. So I feel like you need to at least order up one size for wherever, you know, whatever finger that you want to wear it on. But this is a great color. This is the color that I wanted. It has the blue and the pink and the oranges in it. So yeah, love this ring. All right, so this item I got on special. So remember when I told you that I put more expensive stuff and I let it just sit in my cart and then they send me these text messages and tell me, hey, we got a bonus for you or whatever. That's what happened with this one. So uh, it was supposed to be giving me like 90% off, though it's never really 90% off, but it is a lot cheaper than what it would normally be. So I got this one for $4.14. And it's just like one of those little uh, rattan. Okay, sorry about that. When the old lady wants to go outside and go potty, you gotta take the old lady outside to go potty. So I don't know where I was, but we're just gonna pick right back up with this one. So this is just like a little rattan, little uh, tray for your table or dresser or whatever. Just keep little trinkets on, candles, whatever. I would say, I think this one's probably around 10 to 12 inches in diameter. I think, I think this is the large one, I'm not positive. I think this might have been the large one, but it just has these little wooden handles. It's actually made pretty decent for what I paid for it. Uh, what I say, I paid $4.14 for it. So because I got it on that discount, I'm not sure what it was regularly. I'll put it up here somewhere how much it is regularly, but 
I mean, it's pretty well made. These were bent a little bit when I got it, but they do move. So you just got to do it easy so that you don't snap them. But yeah, how cute is that? Don't you love it? I love this. So this is gonna go up in the room. We have a spare bedroom upstairs that we are in the middle of redoing. And so I bought this for that room. So this is super cute. Okay, so next up is this little set that I bought. It's actually two earrings. It's a set of earrings for my second, uh, for my regular one and then my second uh, hole right there. And then I got a matching ring too. So y'all know I'm a pink girl. I love my pink. So my ring I paid 89 cents for. Uh, this little set of earrings right here I paid $2.48 for. And then I did get a price adjustment of four cents on that one. And then these earrings I paid $1.68 for. And so I'm gonna uh, show them to you here real quick and I'll do close-ups for you so that you can see them all. These are gonna be so cute together, I thought. They didn't come together but they kind of were like showing up in my feed almost together. So yeah, that's why I grabbed them. And they're just way, way too cute. I really enjoy these earrings because they're like a 3D effect. So it's gonna look like, it's kind of gonna look like you have more earrings in than what you do. And I got the gold, I think they had, uh, I think they had silver too but I went ahead and got the yellow gold in these because I just thought that the yellow gold looked better with the pink because it's like a hot pink. And then here's just the little hoops. They're like pink and gold hoops and I got these for uh, my second hole. And then here's the fun little ring I got to match them all. Can't wait to wear all these together. I love it. Ooh, y'all know my birthday is this week. So we are going to the Brandon Lake concert and I know that I had bought a pair of earrings to match uh, one of the t-shirts that I'm wearing, but honestly, the one that I decided on has pink in it. So maybe I'll wear this jewelry with that then, because it's just super, super cute, very fun. Oh yeah. Oh, so I absolutely love this ring. How cute is that? That's just, just a big old pink ring, love that. And then here's the earrings and I'm gonna try these on for you. Okay guys, so I got them all in. Now I'm gonna grab this uh, face lotion, this moisturizer, and we're gonna head into the bathroom and I'm going to demonstrate the difference between the two for you. The ones that I bought from Amazon on Amazon Prime Day and the ones that I got off of Timu. And I'm gonna show you the name of the difference, or the name difference that's on them, the packaging, and all of that, and what the prices are. So let's go head into the bathroom. Okay, well, here's my earrings that you can see first while we're in the bathroom. This is just my little downstairs bathroom that we have. So I figured this would be the easiest for me to actually show y'all um, this, uh, moisturizer just because I have a little sink and stuff right here now remember I don't have any makeup on my face at all just a little bit of mascara and my lip gloss is pretty much gone now so I'm gonna show you what I bought from Amazon first okay and I paid this is called advanced snail mucin right power essence and this is what I got from Amazon right here. Here it is. And then I'm going to show you, and I paid $18.19 for this one, right? Now, this is what I got from Timu. So you can see that they are very similar, right? This one is made by Cos Rx, C O S R X. It says it like right there, right? And then this is made by O-U-H-O-E, Yuho. <laughs> I have no idea how to even say that, but these are the two items. So here it is out of the packaging. And the bottles are different, as you can tell. One's obviously larger than the other, but this one actually has like some give to it. This one does not. This is a much harder plastic bottle than this one. 
And even though they say the same exact thing, advanced snail 96 mucin power essence, I am going to show you the difference between the two. So I've been using this for uh, ever since Prime Day. So what's that been like? A little over a month now and that's all that I've used. I use this uh, immediately after getting out of the bathtub or the shower because your face needs to be uh, damp when you put this one on. Don't put it on with your face dry. It doesn't have to be like soaked or anything, but it does need to be damp for it to go on to get the most effects out of it. So I'm gonna show you, we'll do these first, and I'll show you the difference between the two on these. Now we're gonna go, I'm gonna show you, let's show you the Timu one first. So even though the packaging is super close, I thought I was gonna probably be getting a great deal. I paid four, I wrote it down for you. I paid $4.98 for this, and then I got a price reduction of 53 cents, and then I got a price reduction of 21 cents. So that brings me down to like $4 and change, like 10 cents or something, right around there, right? So this is what this looks like. And so you would take like a couple of pumps, right? So you could see that this is like really like runny, right? And snail mucin, should come apart like for your fingers right whenever you do this that's how you kind of know it looks it's kind of like sticky like webby right that's what that is this doesn't do that at all and this has a perfume smell too i know y'all can't smell it but trust me it has a perfume smell to it so this is just like very watery as you can tell it's just like super watery. I'm going to wash my hands and then I'm going to show you what the other one looks like. Okay, so I'm going to get my face a little bit damp, right? So we talked about that, how it needs to be damp. Now, this is the one that I got from Amazon and when I pump this in my hand, you're going to see a difference. So here it is. One, I use the same two pumps and I don't know if you can tell but this one is like more of like a gel so see what I mean see how it like looks webby and that's how it should look just like that now when you put this on your face don't you don't rub it in you pat it right you pat it in your face so that you get the most effects from it now, I follow like uh, a dermatologist. I can't think of her name right this moment, but I'll put her I'll put her channel for you down in the description in case you want to follow her too. But she's a dermatologist on TikTok and she is really good. Like you should watch her. <laughs> I like her a lot. She's, you know, smart lady. Obviously, she knows her profession. So, yeah. And you just pat this in. I like to put it on my neck too, cause you know, we're gonna be 50 this year. So we're, we're gonna need all the help we can get. <laughs> we need all the help we can get, right? So here we go. Now, see the difference? See how nice and moisturized it is? Yeah. So I always like let this dry after I get out of the shower, you know, do your hair, yada, yada, let it all dry. And then I use the other one that I got and we're going to get into that one next. Okay. So I have my hands washed and my face is pretty much dry. It might have a little, few little tacky areas, but that's okay. This is the second part that I got. So this is also the snail uh, 92 advanced all in one cream. So this cream I actually use whenever I use it whenever my face is like feeling dried out or whatever, which is pretty often for me. I have extremely dry skin. My skin is so dry that I could probably, well, I not could probably, I can put straight baby oil on my face and it will soak it up and I won't get like any zits or anything like that which I'm super blessed in that, in that aspect. Uh, I do hate the dry skin, but 
Honestly, I would rather have dry skin than oily skin. So I'm sure y'all can feel me. Uh, if you have oily skin, my husband does, and he absolutely hates it. <laughs> but anyway, this is the one that I got from Amazon. I paid 18, I put little tags on here. I paid $18.94 for this. I got back onto my old Amazon orders to see exactly what I paid for this. This is uh, how much it is right now on Amazon. And then this is the one that I got from Timu. Now I paid $4.49 for this. So here is the difference in size right there. And again, they look extremely similar, but the tags are just a little bit different. And you can tell right here that this one's made by Coast RX, or I don't know exactly how you say it. That's how I say it. And then this one's that Ow Ho or Ooh Hoo or however you say it, I really don't know. But here are these. Now we're gonna, I'm gonna open up this one first from Timu so that you can see this one. And I already took like the um, the inside tab off. It did have like a security type thing on there. I took it off already. Now, I can immediately tell a difference between these two when I open the lid. One, because of the smell. So again, this, there's no smell to this. It doesn't have a smell to it at all. This smells like my favorite thing in the whole world, which is gardenias. Like I love anything that smells like gardenias. I have a, a gardenia bush out front. If y'all have one, then you know it doesn't bloom that often, <laughs> but when it does, it's amazing and it smells so good. So that's what this smells like. Now, we're gonna do the same test with this, just like we did with uh, the other part that we already put on the face. And so we're gonna grab some of this. Now see, this looks like lotion to me, right? This looks just like regular lotion to me. Smells like gardenias. And look, no, no little webby properties to it at all, right? It's very milky and I'm not gonna put it on my face just because I wanna put the other one on my face so that you can see. But you, I mean, you can just tell from looking at it that it's, it's very milky, kind of watery, smells amazing though. So honestly, for the price, I'm gonna use this for my hands because my hands get just as dry you know, as, as everywhere else. And I love the smell. It smells so good. And I would probably buy this again just for my hands because you always need a good hand cream. And I feel like this is good for that. Plus I want to smell gardenias all day. I mean, I'm just saying. So honestly, that's what I would purchase this one for, but not for my face. It's not going to give me the same effect. I don't believe I know it's not of the actual snail mucin. and so we're gonna go and I'm let me show you the other one so this was the Timu one now here's the one from Amazon so I paid again 1894 for it I think yeah and the other one was 1819 now you're gonna see <laughs> I use this a lot too, and you can tell there's hardly any gone. This is gonna last you a really long time. So even though it's 18, 19, it's gonna last you a really long time. I'm gonna, I'll, I'll tell you in a minute. So here, see that? Look at the difference. <laughs> like that's what this stuff should look like. If it's legit snail mucin, it should look just like this. Nice and webby, just like that. All right, so put it in my hand. Look at that. That's major. That is so nice, right? So it should look just like this. Now this, this I just go ahead and rub it in, you know, everywhere. I have, I get really dry patches right there. I'm sure it's from the sun because I'm always out in the sun all the time, all over my face. Let's get some more of that good stuff. This stuff's amazing. It will feel, it just glides on your face. And it, I mean, you can just see how easy it goes on. And it just makes your face feel so good. 
I love it. It really does. You got to get up underneath the brow bone. Get all the good stuff. It does say don't get in your eyes. So don't get it in your eyes. But look, I get it as close as I can because I need everything. I need it all. <laughs> Here, let's get some more for our neck. <laughs> need some of that on the neck. Since we're already here, I mean, right? She get it all in there. Can't hurt. Now this is the all-in-one. So you can put this on anytime you want. Anytime your little heart desires. The other one, I usually just use it when I get out of the shower. Honestly, that's when I use it. So yeah, this feels silky on your skin. It feels really good. And I do not claim to be any kind of like makeup person or product person <laughs> or anything like that. I am just a regular 50 year old girl that lives in South Mississippi that needs all the moisture she can on her face. <laughs> and I'm just sharing that with y'all. That's it, that's all this is. So I want you to see the difference between the ones from Timu and the ones that I got off of Amazon. I'm gonna put the links down in the description for you of both of these. So if you're looking for the ones for Amazon, I will put Amazon and then the links for those that were on Amazon, the same exact ones that I bought so that you don't get a different one. And then I'll put the links for the Timu one if you wanna try those out too. Look, and if you, if you like gardenias, like I do, then you might want to try this one because I feel like it's a good, it's a good buy for $4.49 as a hand cream. I'm going to keep this in my purse for whenever I get done thrifting and all. I'm constantly putting hand sanitizer on my hands so my hands are constantly dried out and this is just going to make them smell good after the hand sanitizer. So I'm definitely going to use it for this and if it does have any of the snail mucin and properties in it, well, then it definitely can't hurt, you know, the aging on your hands that we all get when you become our age. So I would definitely recommend it for that. And as far as this one goes from Timu, I would not recommend this honestly for anything because it's so watery and it just didn't feel like anything. It just felt like, I mean, you can even see it. It's just like, it's just like water. So this, I'm definitely gonna review this uh, on Timu. I don't do a whole lot of reviews on there because I do them all on here on my YouTube channel, but honestly, I am gonna get on there and I will review this because this one, it's got a scent to it, which it shouldn't, and it just has zero of the snail mucin properties that it's supposed to have. So this one's a definitely a no-go for me. I, I can't even think of a reason that you would use it for anything. Okay guys, well give me a thumbs up for this, will ya? This was a lot, putting this face on the internet for thousands of people to look at with no makeup on. This, is, this was difficult for me, but I thought y'all should know and hey, we all need a good facial moisturizer. So if you've never heard of this snail mucin before, look it up, it's viral, it is all over TikTok, it's all over everywhere. Uh, dermatologists are talking about it. Everybody's talking about it. So, I mean, it didn't hurt to try it. And I'm telling you, that's probably the only thing that I'm going to be using for a really long time. I hope you all enjoyed the video. Don't forget about next week. Make sure that you're subscribed. Cross your fingers that everything works out okay and we are able to do it next week if something happens where Tim's stuff doesn't come in. I'll put up another community post for you all so that you can see it and let you know whether or not it's going to be happening next week. I hope you all have a great week coming up. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Bye, y'all.